friends, my name is Lauren, Director of Visitor Experience here at Children's Museum Houston, and today's Brain Break is sponsored by Philip 66 for our Read and Rhyme Wonder Week. And today I am with... Danny Dancer, and I am the Social Studies Educator here at Children's Museum Houston. And because this Wonder Week is all about rhyming, we are actually going to play a little game. This is a really fun one for you all to try at home. So if you've ever played the game concentration before. We're gonna use concentration to see how many words we can come up with that rhyme with a starting word. So for example, if I gave the word boy, then Lauren could give the word toy. And then I could give the word soy. That's a word, I came up with it, we're there. Okay, but we're gonna do it in rhythm. And the rhythm goes like this, we're just gonna go. All right, and every time you do the first pat on the legs, that's when you have to say the word. Now, as we just go back and forth between the two of us coming up with rhyming words, if somebody can't think of a word that rhymes or repeats a word or gets off rhythm or makes up a word that doesn't really exist, which might happen, um, then we start over with a new word, but we have to go a little bit faster. Lauren, are you ready? I think so. All right, do you wanna come up with the first word? Sure. Okay, here we go. Concentration now in session. Ready? Begin. Doll. Paul. Ball. Tall. Wall. Shawl. Fall. <laughs> I got it that time. <laughs> all right, all right. One more word. Should we go? Should we go a little faster? Yeah. A little faster. Okay. Do you have Do you have a word? Let me think. <laughs> is it Is it going to be easy? Because I apparently struggle with this. Um. Yeah. Okay. okay. I think I got one. All right. Here we go. Concentration. <laughs> now in session. I'm already nervous. Begin. Boat. Boat. <laughs> Float. Goat. That's the ball word. Scoot. <laughs> That's the only other one I could come up with. All right. And that's pretty much how the game is played. Now you can play this with two people just going back and forth. If you have a larger group of people, you can go in a circle or you can do something like grab a bean bag and toss it around the circle. The next person who catches the bag has to come up with the next word. It's a pretty fun, pretty simple game. I hope you all will try it at home. In the meantime, thank you so much for joining us for today's Brain Break, which was sponsored by Philip 66 as part of our Read and Rhyme Wonder Week. Have a great day. Bye.